the shirt chronicles, a wearable journey. It was a sunny day when Sarah decided to embark on a wearable journey. She opened her closet and stared at the array of shirts hanging neatly on hangers. There were shirts made of different materials like cotton, polyester, silk, and linen. Each shirt had its own story to tell, and Sarah was eager to discover them all. She reached for a soft cotton shirt, feeling the smooth fabric between her fingers. Cotton was one of her favorite materials because it was breathable and comfortable to wear. Sarah knew that cotton came from the cotton plant, which grew in warm climates. She admired the versatility of cotton shirts, perfect for any occasion. Next, Sarah picked up a polyester shirt. Polyester was a man-made material known for its durability and wrinkle resistance. Sarah liked wearing polyester shirts when she needed something easy to care for. She knew that polyester was made from synthetic fibers, which were created in a factory instead of being grown naturally. Moving on, Sarah chose a silk shirt. Silk was a luxurious material that felt smooth and cool against her skin. Sarah knew that silk came from silkworms, which spun delicate threads to create the fabric. She loved the elegant drape of silk shirts, perfect for dressing up for special occasions. Lastly, Sarah selected a linen shirt. Linen was a breathable and lightweight material that was perfect for hot weather. Sarah liked the natural texture of linen shirts, giving her a relaxed and casual look. She knew that linen was made from the flax plant, which produced strong fibers used to weave the fabric. As Sarah packed her shirts for her journey, she marveled at the different materials that made up her clothing. Each shirt had its own unique qualities and characteristics, reflecting the diverse world of wearable fashion. Sarah was excited to see where her journey would take her, with her shirts as her trusted companions. With a smile, Sarah closed her closet door and set off on her wearable journey. She knew that the shirts she wore would not only protect her body, but also express her personal style and taste. As she walked down the street, the sun shining above her, Sarah felt a sense of freedom and joy in the endless possibilities that lay ahead. The shirt chronicles had only just begun, and Sarah was ready to embrace every moment of it. Question, what are some common materials used to make shirts? Check the video description for the answer. The shirt chronicles, a wearable journey. James loved his shirts. He had a collection of all different colors and patterns, each one telling a story of where he had been and what he had done. His shirts were more than just clothing to him, they were a wearable journey. Every week, James would carefully wash his shirts to make sure they stayed clean and fresh. He knew that taking care of his clothes meant they would last longer and he could continue to enjoy wearing them. His favorite method was to wash them in cold water to keep the colors bright and vibrant. One day, James accidentally spilled bleach on one of his favorite shirts. He was devastated, thinking that he would have to say goodbye to that particular shirt. But then he remembered a trick he had read about online. He could try soaking the shirt in cold water to help remove the bleach stains. James decided to give it a try. He filled a bucket with cold water and gently placed the shirt inside, making sure it was fully submerged. He let it sit for a few hours, checking on it every so often to see if the bleach stains were fading. To his surprise, the stains started to disappear. James was overjoyed that he could save his favorite shirt. After letting it air dry, he carefully folded it and put it back in his closet. Good as new. From that day on, James was extra careful when handling bleach around his shirts. He learned the importance of reading labels and following care instructions to keep his clothes looking their best. As James continued on his wearable journey, he made sure to wash his shirts in cold water and air dry them to ensure they stayed in top condition. He enjoyed taking care of his clothes and knew that by doing so, he could continue to create new memories in each shirt 
he wore. His shirts became more than just pieces of fabric. They were a part of his daily life, accompanying him on all of his adventures. James treasured each one and looked forward to the stories they would tell in the years to come. Question. How can you properly care for your shirts? Check the video description for the answer.